Cindy Hyde Smith born May 10, 1959, is an American politician and cattle rancher who is the junior United States Senator from Mississippi, in office since April 2018. A member of the Republican Party, she was previously the Mississippi Commissioner of Agriculture and Commerce and a member of the Mississippi State Senate. Born in Brookhaven, Mississippi, Hyde Smith is a graduate of Copia Lincoln Community College and the University of Southern Mississippi. In 1999, she was elected to the Mississippi State Senate as a Democrat. She represented the 39th District from 2000 to 2012. In 2010, Hyde Smith switched parties and became a Republican, citing her conservative beliefs. Hyde Smith was elected Mississippi Agriculture Commissioner in 2011, the first woman elected to that office. On March 21, 2018, Governor Phil Bryant announced his intention to appoint Hyde Smith to the United States Senate seat being vacated due to the resignation of Thad Cochran. Hyde Smith was sworn into office on April 9, 2018. She is the first woman to represent Mississippi in Congress. Hyde Smith was a candidate in the 2018 U.S. Senate special election for the remainder of Cochran's term, which expires in 2021. She finished first in the top two general election on November 6, 2018, but did not receive more than 50% of the vote, thus advancing to a November 27 special runoff election versus Mike Espy. Hyde Smith won the runoff election, becoming the first woman elected to Congress from Mississippi. <laughs> Early life Hyde Smith was born in Brookhaven, Mississippi, the daughter of Lorraine Hyde and Luther Hyde, and grew up in Monticello, Mississippi. She attended Lawrence County Academy in Monticello, a segregation academy established in response to Supreme Court rulings ordering the desegregation of public schools. The school's team nickname was the Rebels, the mascot was a call Reb who carried a Confederate flag. She graduated from Copia Lincoln Community College and the University of Southern Mississippi. Early political career Hyde Smith was a member of the Mississippi Senate, representing the 39th District from 2000 to 2012. She had a conservative voting record in the state Senate, and in 2010, she switched parties from Democratic to Republican. Hyde Smith's switch made the Senate equally divided between Republicans and Democrats, with each holding 26 seats. Hyde Smith chaired the Senate Agriculture Committee from 2004 to 2012 and was a member of the Appropriations, Constitution, Corrections, Elections, Forestry, Public Health and Welfare, Veterans and Military Affairs, and Wildlife, Fisheries and Parks Committees. She was also vice chair of the National Agriculture Committee of State Legislators. Mississippi Commissioner of Agriculture and Commerce Hyde Smith was elected in 2011 and took office on January 5, 2012. Hyde Smith was elected to a second term as commissioner as 2015, defeating Democratic nominee Addie Lee Green. U.S. Senate Appointment On March 21, 2018, Governor Phil Bryant announced Hyde Smith as his choice to fill the United States Senate seat held by Thad Cochran, who indicated he would be resigning the seat at a later date due to ongoing health issues. Cochran resigned on April 1, and Bryant formally appointed Hyde Smith on April 2. Hyde Smith became the first woman to represent Mississippi in the United States Congress. The Senate was in a district work period and was not conducting legislative business at that time, so she did not take the oath of office until the Senate reconvened for legislative business on April 9. Hyde Smith announced that she would seek election to the seat in the 2018 special election on November 6. Special election campaign, 2018 The Trump administration reportedly did not support Hyde Smith's appointment because of her history as a Democrat, but in August, Trump endorsed her candidacy. He stumped for Hyde Smith in suburban North Mississippi. Hyde Smith declined to debate her Democratic opponent, Mike Espy, before the November 6 special election. Cochran had often done the same. 
After she and SP each finished with about 41% of the vote, she agreed to debate SP on November 20. The runoff election was held on November 27, 2018. With nearly 99% of the vote counted, Hyde Smith was declared the winner with 53.8% of the vote. During the runoff campaign, while appearing with cattle rancher Colin Hutchinson in Tupelo, Mississippi, Hyde Smith said, If he invited me to a public hanging, I'd be in the front row. Hyde Smith's comment immediately drew harsh criticism, given Mississippi's notorious history of lynchings and public executions of African Americans. In response to the criticism, Hyde Smith downplayed her comment as an exaggerated expression of regard and characterized the backlash as ridiculous. Hyde Smith joined Mississippi Governor Phil Bryant at a news conference in Jackson, Mississippi on November 12, 2018, where she was asked repeatedly about her comment by reporters. In the footage, Hyde Smith adamantly refused to provide any substantive answer to reporters' questions, responding on five occasions with variations of I put out a statement yesterday, and that's all I'm gonna say about it." When reporters redirected questions to Bryant, he defended Hyde Smith's comment, and changed the subject to abortion, saying he was, "...confused about where the outrage is at about 20 million African American children that have been aborted." On November 15, 2018, Hyde Smith appeared in a video clip saying that it would be, "...a great idea," to make it more difficult for liberals to vote. Her campaign stated that Hyde Smith was making an obvious joke, and the video was selectively edited. Both this and the "'public hanging' video were released by Lamar White Jr., a Louisiana blogger and journalist. Committee assignments Committee on Agriculture, Nutrition and Forestry Committee on Appropriation Subcommittee on Agriculture, Rural Development, Food and Drug Administration, and Related Agencies Subcommittee on the Interior, Environment, and Related Agencies Subcommittee on Labor, Health and Human Services, Education, and Related Agencies Subcommittee on the Legislative Branch Subcommittee on State, Foreign Operations, and Related Programs Committee on Rules and Administration Political positions Hyde Smith identifies herself as a conservative Republican. From 1999 to 2010, she served in elected office as a Democrat. She voted in the Democratic primary in 2008, and described herself as having been a conservative Democrat during her tenure in the state legislature. She switched to the Republican Party in 2010. In 2012, Hyde Smith endorsed Republican nominee Mitt Romney for U.S. President. In 2018, as a Republican, she faced a primary challenge from Chris McDaniel, who criticized her past Democratic affiliation. Hyde Smith responded that she had "...always been a conservative," and had the support of Republican Governor Phil Bryant. She highlighted her support for Second Amendment rights, opposition to abortion, and advocacy for the state's defense business. Through June 2018, Hyde Smith voted in line with Trump's position more often than any other Republican senator. 538, which tracks congressional votes, reported that as of October 2018 she had voted with Trump's position 100% of the time. She has mixed ratings from political action committees representing a range of views on the ideological spectrum. In 2018, the Conservative Review gave Hyde Smith a 50% rating in Numbers USA, which opposes illegal immigration and seeks to reduce legal immigration, gave her a 77% score. The American Civil Liberties Union gave her a 0% score and the Mississippi Human Services Coalition, which generally gave Democrats higher scores than most Republicans, gave Hyde Smith a rating of 33% in 2008 and 56% in 2006. Fiscal policy Hyde Smith describes her economic positions as fiscally conservative. In 2018, Hyde Smith was one of 29 Republicans who joined all Democrats in opposing Senator Rand Paul's bill to cut federal spending by 1% over five years, known as the Penny Bill. Republican opponents of the bill said it could threaten federal defense and domestic programs. She faced criticism from the bill's supporters. Hyde Smith supported the Trump backed Tax Cuts and Jobs Act of 2017. As a state legislator, she voted in favor of increasing unemployment benefits and in favor of raising taxes on cigarettes. 
She also voted with all Mississippi Democrats in the state legislature to restore funding that had been previously eliminated due to budget cuts. <laughs> Health care Hyde Smith opposes the Affordable Care Act Obamacare, saying that it has failed Mississippi. She is in favor of repealing it but keeping provisions ensuring protections for pre-existing conditions. While in the Senate, she voted to expand the use of short-term health insurance plans, which can discriminate against people with pre-existing conditions. Topic social issues Hyde Smith's campaign describes her as a strong social conservative voting record with a 100% pro-life rating who is a lifetime member of the NRA, Gun Owners of America, which supports gun owners' rights and is in favor of loosening restrictions on guns, gave her a rating of 50% in 2018. Hyde Smith considers herself pro-life and opposes abortion. As a state senator, she authored a bill requiring that all abortions after 12 weeks of pregnancy be performed in a hospital or ambulatory surgical facility. The bill was blocked by federal courts. In 2018, she voted with Senate Republicans to prohibit federal funding from being given to any organization or facility that promotes abortion services or family planning. She opposes Planned Parenthood, describing it as one of the worst things that has ever happened to us. In 2018, Hyde Smith released a statement supporting the Trump administration's travel ban. Her campaign website says she supports the construction of a wall along the southern U.S. border. In 2012, as the Commissioner of Agriculture and Commerce, Hyde Smith was personally opposed to a same sex commitment ceremony at the Mississippi Agriculture and Forestry Museum, but instructed the museum to allow it after consulting with Mississippi Attorney General Jim Hood. She declared she would seek a change in state law and request from the legislature, clear and straightforward definitions about what activities can take place on the property owned by the state of Mississippi. <laughs> <laughs> Confederate States of America In 2007, Hyde Smith voted for a resolution that praised a Confederate States Army soldier for his efforts to defend his homeland. During her first term in the Mississippi Senate, she proposed renaming a state highway after Confederate President Jefferson Davis, but the legislation did not pass. In 2014, Hyde Smith posted a photo of herself at Davis's home, Beauvoir, wearing a Confederate cap and carrying a rifle, with the caption, "'Mississippi History at its Best'". <laughs> Personal life Hyde Smith is married to a cattle farmer, Mike Smith. They are members of the Macedonia Baptist Church. They have a daughter, Anna Michael, who graduated in May 2017 from Brookhaven Academy, a segregation academy. Hyde Smith is a member of the American Cancer Society, the Junior Auxiliary, Hospice, the Mississippi Cattlemen's Association, the Mississippi Wildlife Federation, the National Rifle Association, Mississippi National Guard Legislative Caucus, and the Copia Lincoln Community College Foundation Board. Electoral <inaudible> <inaudible> history <inaudible> Topic two thousand three. Topic two thousand seven. Topic twenty eleven. Topic twenty fifteen. Topic twenty eighteen. Topic See also List of party switchers in the United States.